Hello, welcome to my channel. Hello guys, this is Emma Vargas and I'm glad to have you here, all you here in my channel. It's time to learn a new topic that is called prepositions of places. And I was explaining this to my student, to my dear student David that was taking yesterday's class. And I was explaining him that we use prepositions of places to mention something and to be or to try to be more accurate when we are speaking so this gives a complete sense of where things are and i'm going to list or i'm going to write here or label here the most common so th let me start i'm going to grab my red marker and the first preposition of place is going to be on and this is a preposition that we use it all the time. I can use it on, like on Mondays. And when something is on, on a table, or for example, the diploma or that picture is on the wall. And I'm using on to explain something that is above something. And that is something that is another, or connects to another that is above. Okay, the picture is above the diploma. And I can consider this line like the, the limit, and then above we have a picture. Then we have under, that is the opposite. These are opposite. We have under, that is going to be under, and if this is the picture under the picture is the diploma then i'm going to use the preposition preposition of place that is in front of. in front of i am in front of my cell phone i am in front of you in front of a camera or my house is in front of my my neighbor alejandra or my in, the, in front of my house, there is a neighbor called Alejandra. So we can also consider the preposition in. And if we take a box or if we consider a box like a, something that is here. This is a box and something that is right inside of the box is in. Well, it looks like it's above. It could be on. But I'm trying to mention this like a shadow. So the, the thing is in, in, in the box. Now we have more, more prepositions of places. The next preposition is between. That what is the difference between, between and among? Between is considered between two things. So I consider this point and this point and the dot right here is between both points uh, then I have a cross from that is a considered like a line we have and a cross from you have to cross the line to go to the next part of the street or the neighborhood then we have next to so the board or the diplomas are next to the window and well these are prepositions of places that are used to mention or to give some place something that is in a very specific place i hope you like this video see you in our next video